Hey guys, Bill here for Destructoid, and we are getting yet another Dead Island title. Deep Silver has announced that they are coming out with Escape Dead Island, a story-driven, stealthy survival mystery. Ooh. Escape Dead Island puts you in the shoes of Cliff, a loudmouth jerk who is part of a three-person documentary team who has come to the Dead Island to investigate the outbreak and obviously become trapped and have to find a way to survive and escape the Dead Island. So the Dead Island that you must escape in this game is the same island from the first game, Benoit. Uh, the events take place six weeks after the first game and will act as a bridge between Dead Island 1 and 2. Unlike the other Dead Island games where you're driving cars through zombies and kicking them in the face and breaking oars over their head, you're going to be sneaking around zombies this time and trying not to get caught because they will murder your throat. So this game is going to have some sort of weird time loop mechanic where the main character wakes up every day the same day at 4.37, but you collect materials and unlock new parts of the of the map, kind of like a 3D Metroidvania they described as like Darksiders or Zelda. Um, so you do make progress even though it's a time loop, so I'm feeling like it's going to be kind of a Majora's Mask type deal. Uh, the other interesting thing is that Cliff will undergo these insanity moments where all the color drains from the game. And we don't really know much about that yet, but it looks really cool. So Escape Dead Island is coming to us from Fat Shark in Sweden. You may know them as the people who developed Bionic Commando Rearmed 2, or Lead in Gold, or War of the Roses, or Hamilton's Great Adventure? So this game's gonna be 40 bucks. It's coming to Xbox 360, PS3, and PC this fall. I don't have very high hopes for this game, but I feel like there might be something kind of interesting in there with the whole time loop mechanic. Uh, but if you pick it up, you do get access to the Dead Island 2 beta which is also interesting, but we also don't know much about that. Uh, anyway, you can find out more about Dead Island and all of its spin-offs and sequels at Destructoid.com where they write articles about video game news. You can also see more videos where we tell you the news. If that's what you're into right here on this channel, please subscribe and tell your friends and send me nice letters in the mail. <laughs>